there, boy. Are you telling me you're the owner of the Bubba Gump Shrimp Corporation? Yes, sir. We got more money than David Crawford. You no know, shrimp. Where the hell's this god of yours? It's funny Lieutenant Dan said that. Because right then, God showed up. Lieutenant Dan, he was mad. Come on! You call this a storm? Oh, you son of a bitch! Oh! It's time for a showdown! You and me! I'm right here! Come and get me! <laughs> you never sink this boat! Hurricane Carmen came through here yesterday, destroying nearly everything in its path. And as in other towns up and down the coast, BioLabattery's entire shrimping industry has fallen victim to Carmen and has been left in utter ruin. Speaking with local officials, this reporter has learned, in fact, only one shrimping boat actually survived the storm. Louise! Louise, that's forced. After that, shrimping was easy. Since people still needed them shrimps for shrimp cocktails and barbecues and all, and we were the only boat left standing, Bubba Gump shrimp's what they got. We got a whole bunch of boats, 12 jennies, big old warehouse. We even have hats that say Bubba Gump on them. Bubba Gump shrimp. It's a household name. Hold on there, boy. Are you telling me you're the owner of the Bubba Gump Shrimp Corporation? Yes, sir. We got more money than David Crockett. <laughs> Boy, I heard some whoppers in my time, but that tops them all. <laughs> we were sitting next to a millionaire. <laughs> well, I thought it was a very lovely story. And you tell it so well with such enthusiasm. Would you like to see what Lieutenant Dan looks like? Well, yes, I would. That's him right there. Hmm. And let me tell you something about Lieutenant Dan. Forrest. I never thanked you for saving my life. <laughs> 